Okay, to do this problem, the first step is to label each digit with a place value. So I mark them off like this, and that 3 is in the 1's column. Since this is base 7, the next column over is uh, the 7's column. Next, what I'm going to do is multiply each digit by its value. So that 2 is in the 7's column, so it's worth 2 times 7, which is 14. And that 3 is in the 1's column, so it's worth 3 times 1, which is just 3. So the 2 is worth 14, and the 3 is worth 3. I add them up together, and 14 plus 3 is equal to 17. I'm going to label each of these digits with a place value for the column. So that first column is always the 1's column. The next one is base seven, or 7, because it's base 7. And that third one is the 7 times 7's column, or the 49's column. Now what I'm going to do is multiply each digit by its value. So the 1 is worth 49, because it's 1 four times 49, so it's just 49. The 0 is just a placeholder, so 0 is always just worth 0. The 5 is in the 1's column, so it's worth 5 times 1, which is just 5. If I add those up, I get 54, and that's the answer. For this one, we'll use the same place values like the, like the previous problems. That 2 is in the 49's column, so it's worth 98. The 3 is in the, tw the 7's column, so it's worth 21. And the 6 is in the 1's column, so it's worth 6. I add up those values, and that gives me 125. And that's the answer.